President Donald Trump, Trump is hitting back at Saturday Night Live. This after the show featured Alec Baldwin playing the president yet again, and Trump wasn't too happy. He tweeted, quote, a real scandal is the one-sided coverage of networks like NBC and Democrat spin machines like Saturday Night Live. He also adds it should be tested in courts. Here's a clip from the show. See if you think it deserves a presidential critique. Sometimes I wish I had never been president. A world where you were never president, eh? <laughs> I think we can arrange that. Wow, everyone looks so different. What are those things on their faces? Those are called smiles. But, but is SNL doing anything new? Let's take a look back. Why should I gloat? I've been impeached by the House. It is I, George W. Bush. And you're right, remember, the W stands for What's up? I am psyched for Obamacare. <laughs> there you go. I love that enthusiasm. <laughs> I love it. Tori, I got to go to you. Uh, you're our legal eagle. I want to highlight the part that a lot of people on social media are taking issue with when he said to the, I'm taking this to the, or I, I may, I want to take this to the courts. Right. So there's three things real quick. I'm going to give you layman's cliff notes terms on why this is wacky. <laughs> Number one. Was that the first one? That's the number one. Number one, if we can just go to the tweet really quick. If you guys read Donald Trump saying, new unfair news coverage. In news, you do have to show the left and then give side to the right. SNL is not a news show. It's a comedy show. So we are in a completely di different universe. Number two, he says, take it to the courts. We did. 1988, it went to Hustler v. Falwell. This is the very famous Larry Flint case. Are you already asleep? <laughs> Larry, no, please keep going. This it's is very important. important. <laughs> Larry thing. Flint went to court and uh, Jerry Falwell, there was a parody about a cartoon. And unanimously, all eight judges at that time said, satire, if a reasonable person wouldn't think it's real, it is protected. So it widely encompassed a lot of protection so of satire. Can't take it to the courts. Not only did we take it to the courts, they already lost. And three, when you threaten to use the government resources to take down satirical, which I think is one of the most patriotic forms of communication, we are lucky to make fun of our leaders. I'm not kind of joking about that. You, it's a dangerous step to take. You don't tweet about that as the pre president, and you don't threaten to use government resources to take down someone's well-protected freedom of speech. Is this a distraction? Is he tweeting about SNL so we look at SNL and not perhaps the investigations that he's, that he's I, under? I don't I just think he's such a narcissist that he just doesn't want to be made fun of That's at right. all, ever. I mean, we just showed that montage. Every single president, even when we lost uh, Pres President Bush a couple weeks ago, we showed the Dana Carvey clip. I mean, it's what SNL does is they, they poke fun at the president. So, and I mean, that sketch wasn't that scathing. So, I mean. I just wonder if he didn't tweet about it. Like I always say, I wish he didn't tweet. Would we be talking about it today? No, nope. of course not. That's all. I just wish he would tweet a little less. Giving fuel to the fire.